What's good, gang? What's good, squad? I don't know if y'all can see me. It's dark as shit. The light horrible as fuck. But I try to get a good angle. <laughs> I'm still cut the fuck off. Let me just lean up. So, what's today? Today is um, November 30th. Last day of November. And y'all already know what that means. 12 o'clock will be the official first day of, of Vlogmas. So, I had to come with a vlog. It's a must. You know what I'm saying? I ain't did shit all day. All day. Like, I stayed in bed playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Then I came to the mall. Got me some shoes or whatnot. And I'm eating Steak and Shake for the very first time. Steak and Shake. Ooh. Fuck that. I ain't do nothing to get it like a double bacon cheeseburger. Extra mayo on it. Honey mustard for the fries. I was hoping they had like some type of um chicken tender sauce. You know what I'm saying? But they didn't. But it's cool though. So. Oh shit. I'm <laughs> fucking no. So I guess I'm about to get y'all a little muck man. Before I hit the road, back to the city. Back to my city. See what this. Oh, shit. Brown the waist, honey mustard, all on my damn arm wrist. God damn. I don't know how the fuck that happened. Good thing, nigga, you napping, baby. God damn. I'm talking about this shit everywhere. And I just cleaned the car out today. I get about a bit. Let me get the rest of these fries out of your bag before I... <laughs> okay. That means my arm wrist up sticky as hell. You should put that napkin right there. Let's see what the burger hand on. Extra fucking mayo. Ooh. It was good. I'm tired of Thanksgiving food, just like everybody else. This shit like a Krabby Patty, y'all. Mm. Look like a Krabby Patty. Tastes like a Krabby Patty. No cap. <laughs> I don't know what this little season is on here, but it is blessing. Damn, I got bacon falling off the burger. Y'all. Mm-mm-mm. Steak and shape. I am sorry. I am sorry. If we had a steak and shake in my city, bro, I'd be a whole 600 pound life, bitch. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm just hungry as hell. Cause I don't think I had today was some Thanksgiving food. And y'all know how black folks is. The day, the few days after Thanksgiving, you eating Thanksgiving food for goddamn breakfast, <laughs> dinner, lunch all that shit and i had thanksgiving dinner i had a thanksgiving plate with some ham and dressing that motherfucking nine o'clock in the morning this is the first thing i'm gonna eat since 9 a.m and it's 8 17 well yeah hmm Shit. This shit good as fuck. I ain't get no drink. Oh, my dumb ass. I got a cup of ice. Mm-mm. 
with the with the fries with the honey mustard on. I was giving a whole other vibe. I should have got some barbecue sauce. Bacon cheeseburgers are good with, with barbecue sauce. And they got them little bitty ass cut fries. You can put like four of them in your hand and fold them. Mm. Woo. This is busting. Do y'all hear me? <laughs> But no, with this little milk bang though, I just want to come tell y'all, shit, do what you do, baby. Don't wait on nobody to do nothing. Do you hear me? Damn, my onions just fell off. All my onions fell off. Do what you do, baby. Don't wait on nobody to do nothing. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, my God. And y'all know I got mayo on my fucking steering wheel. If y'all didn't know, I love my food sloppy. And that extra mayo made it sloppy Bobby. <laughs> sloppy Bobby, do you hear me? Oh my god. I got everything from the bacon, onions. Look at this. Look at it. That's straight mayo. Mm -mm. Don't wait on nobody to do nothing. If you want to hop on the motherfucking highway and drive to Atlanta, don't wait on nobody to say, oh, I go with you. Oh, I'm ready. None of that. Make that shit happen. It's okay to be solo dolo. And a lot of people feel like, you know, they always got to have somebody go with them places. You can do shit on your own. And you will have a great time. Even if you was with other people. Like, I'm not even going to lie to you. It's not that I'm antisocial. But. I get a better enjoyment. I feel a different energy. When I'm out by myself. Solo dolo. And them just facts, bro. I'm not trying to be funny. It ain't on no... And these folks want to park right beside me. It ain't on no um funny acting type time. It's just on some shit like I really enjoy time by myself. You feel me? That's even if I'm at home playing a game for like four or five hours. I'm cool with that. I might hop on social media or some shit, make a little post. But I don't be sweating my phone, bruh. And um, that's just like today. Well, day before yesterday. I had plans to go out with somebody. We were going to do a little, do our little thug thieves. Go chill. Hang out, right? And. Y'all, they burger so fucking good. I'm sleepy as fuck. But look. So, that person called me and woke me up. Talking about something. Hey, you need to get up. We got to do this. We got to do that. I'm like, yeah, you right. But I'm just playing the day by ear because I know how motherfuckers is. Excuse me. You can plan a trip with a motherfucker. And they'll call you that morning to wake you up. Say, oh, they getting ready. And on your way to scoop them up or meet up at the whatever, wherever y'all meeting at, they not answering their phone. Motherfuckers would do you like that, so... I was just, you know, playing it by ear. Like, okay, you called and woke me up. Bruh, I know what time we said we were going to go do this. I'm sweating. I'm talking about three, four hours before we were supposed to go do what we were supposed to do. Had me thinking that, oh, they really with the shit. But I played it by ear, right? So, 
time slowly winding down. I done text the person. Hey, what's up with it? I'm getting dressed right now. What you up to? No response. Okay, cool. The time, 45 minutes to an hour after we were supposed to leave, I called this person. No answer. Cool. You feel me? I'm talking about a bitch was dressed. I was ready. Had my smell good on. You feel me? The thought about my outfit. I'm, you know, I'm thinking we finna go have a night out. None of that. None of that. I'm just like, wow. Not saying I wasted a whole day, but. My time was wasted. Because I was waiting on motherfuckers. You feel me? Everything me and me and me and uh, that person was supposed to do, I could have did this so, I could have did this shit solo dolo. But what my dumb ass did, just I just wanted to wait. And see. Could I hold them to their word? And they proved me absolutely wrong. So today, I feel like fuck everybody. <laughs> oh, mom. I'm not finna beg you to hang out. Really didn't even want to answer the phone today. For nobody. Because it be full of fucking lies, bro. Don't get me wrong. I know shit. You know, things happen, stuff come up. I get that. But at the same time now, baby, you know better. My time is valuable. I cherish my time. And y'all know I work. Five days a week, you feel me? Yeah, I just smashed it. Oh, how many minutes it been? Twelve minutes. I smashed that shit. Everything gone. Oh, that little burger was good though. It steak and shake put me in the mind of um uh Waterburger, I guess. <laughs> Y'all probably gonna roast me in the comment. But it was good. Like they had seasoning on it. I got a big ass cup of ice with no drink. What wrong with me? Oh. I guess cause I knew it was gonna melt down the water, but I could've just got a cup of water. But yeah. So today I was like, fuck that shit. I, I finally got myself off the game. Went and, you know, got dressed, whatnot. Smell good on. Um, and I was like, fuck that shit. I'm finna hop in the car, listen to Don Kennedy new album. And just ride. So I hit the freeway. I ain't know. I wanted, I knew I was going to the mall. I knew I wanted some shoes, but I had no idea what I wanted or where I wanted to go to. So I went to the Galleria, which is the, uh, one of the biggest malls in my area went there and I just walked around browsed finally made a decision I caught me some shoes man I would have caught me a few outfits and I was gonna go to Bath and Body Works and get me some smell good but they weren't accepting cars at the time which is fucking outrageous like that sound like some bullshit to me so my little mall trip got cut short <clears throat> But, um, yo, I was just like, man, I had, in my mind, I had plans to, you know, invite somebody to come with me. You know, AJ, ride with me up here, da 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 We can spend time, go get food, whatever, whatever, on me. But, <laughs> it ain't my season for that. Right now, my season is to 
do me and do for me point blank period i can go places by myself like i want to go see this queen and slime movie i'm not slime queen and slim i want to go see that bad as fuck i ain't got nobody to go with nobody and i gotta come to a realization that i'm just gonna have to go see that shit by myself ain't nothing wrong with that take yourself on dates spoil yourself you see them new shoes in there that's 260 get them you feel me you ain't got to worry about nobody trying to match your vibe none of that get those for you and that's that's what i'm tapping into right now like i'm really tapping into doing shit for myself doing shit by myself and not worrying about nobody else point blank period like that's really what the vibe is so i'm full as a motherfucker that burger put that that burger hit the spot and I got a 45 minute drive back to my city. So let me buckle up and stay safe for you hoes. You feel me? So y'all see me in the next video. Sorry about the lighting, y'all. It's dark as hell. I tried to park under a little uh, uh, light light lamp, whatever. Street lamp. What did, what did shit called? Post light? <laughs> I don't know. Parking lot light? Some shit. Just so y'all can see my pretty brown skin. But unfortunately it's still dark as fuck so like i said time winding on down i'm finna go ahead and hit the road i'm finna end this video make sure y'all give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and you know just always keep in mind like do shit for yourself i waste i forgot oh i wiped it off i just didn't wipe all of it off But make sure y'all keep in mind, like, do shit for yourself and you never, and always know that you never need anybody to do anything with you. Like, go do that shit on your own. You don't want to go to the hospital because you ain't got nobody to go with you. Bitch, you crazy. Sit there and die. <laughs> Take your ass to the hospital. You feel me? You need to go shopping. Go get your, go get your shit. Stop waiting on motherfuckers, bro. You don't need nobody validation. You don't need to invest your time and other people's time get up and do that shit because at the end of the day if they really fuck with you get what they're gonna ride that train when they stop calling bitch